here with Matthias Lufkins to find out uh, what Davos is going to be doing this year with social media. They've done a lot of interesting stuff in the past. Uh, with uh, what is your biggest success in YouTube views? Well, we had uh, the Davos question last year. It was watched by eight million people. The videos and you know f over four hundred thousand people on the channel itself. So um, eight million views. Eight million views on the different videos. You had two hundred videos from the community and two hundred videos from Davos participants. You know, talking to each other. Uh, all in all, eight million. That was in in February when I counted. I don't know. Uh, okay, but that's all history. That's it's all, all history. history. Okay, exactly. what's coming up this year? What's so exciting? So basically, in you? last year we were, you know, um, we started with the Davos question. This year we're actually doing on the same channel the Davos debates. What are the Davos debates? It's basically an open and frank dialogue between the YouTubers and the participants in Davos in four key areas: the economy, the environment, um, U.S. politics, and ethics. So we're asking. You know, four questions that we want the YouTubers to to answer. You know, for example, um, will you know President Obama or the Obama administration make the world a better place in 2009, or will the environment lose out to the economy? Uh, so these are questions that we're asking um, on the, in the Davos debates. And the best thing about this is that the best video sent in by you, the YouTubers, will actually get a ticket to attend Davos in person. So when when will this ticket be given out? So basically, you know, we're, we have to close, you know, a week before. Has this been announced? It it is online. It is, right. you know, uh, YouTube.com/slash/Davos. Um, get a free so, ticket. You know, get a free ticket if you want to come to Davos, participate in the in the debates. You know, send us your best solution in these, you know, key areas that are affecting our planet today. And you know the best video voted by the community will get the ticket to Davos. It's finishing on the 20th of January, uh, so we have a time, ten, you know, seven days time to sort out the you know the flights, etc. You know, to, to okay. What to about get... other aspects of what you're doing in social media? Other, <clears throat> other aspects. I mean, we're also big on uh, on MySpace and also on Facebook. Facebook this year, what we will be doing, we'll be actually using their pulses. It's basically you know you ask a question to the entire Facebook community, so you have 130 million people. You know. In terms of a country, you know, if, you, if, if Facebook were a country, it's the tenth biggest country in the world, just after Russia. So you know, just so and you can actually put, ask these people one question, and within you know five minutes, you get a thousand answers. So we'll have yes and no answers or multiple choice answers. But it's great to get you know. It's called pulses. It's not a. It's not a poll. It's not a scientific poll, but it gives you a great pulse. So if you integrate that in sessions in Davos, you know, it's you, know, you can ask the. The Davos participants, you know, have 500 people in the room. What do you think? And at the same time, you will ask the world, okay, okay for the, the world on Facebook. But for the person who doesn't win this Davos ticket, who isn't a CEO of a major company, is there a way that they can ask people questions in yes, Davos? Yes, yes, they can. And the last thing we're going to do, we're going to live stream our press conferences in Davos. Not only live streaming, but actually on Mogulus allowing you to chat and allowing you to ask actually in ask English, questions. In English, what does Mogulus mean? I don't know. Non-geek. You know? If you speak non-geek, well, no. What is what is the service? What is Mogulus? Oh, sorry. Mogulus is a, is is like you stream. It's a Kai TV. It's basically a a streaming site that you can stream. So it allows video. people to stream allows video. Allows people, video. Allows people to stream video. It allows you to stream video live on the internet, and it allows you. You know, Mogulus has a chat function where you can actually comment while you're streaming. And it's like also like quick. You know what you do with a mobile phone that you know Tom is uh, holding in his hand here. So so basically, we're opening up press conferences to the world. So the question is, will they still be called press conferences? I have They're world have, conferences. They are world briefings. You know, I have twenty journalists in the room, you know, and then I have the you know the entire world on the internet. Hopefully it will work with a time difference. I mean Davos is in, in Europe, so you know most of the US will be asleep, you know, if we have a press conference in the morning. But uh, I think the Davos the people on the panel in, in in press conferences in Davos are worth you know staying up for. So I okay, think those are the three major things and that what, you know, what if what if people want to get in touch? What are they have a great social media idea of what they can do is is there any Twitter feed they can oh of read course into I mean you know you can, to? you know the product pages you know you can you can join our Facebook group uh, or Facebook fan page but the best thing is probably to follow you know the Twitter feed so it's twitter.com slash Davos uh, Davos that's easy it's, to remember. it's Davos okay. it's basically really to to share the the best comments from the the sessions, um, I don't want to overdo it. I don't want to spam, you know, the followers. But you know, we're, we're still have, you know, we're trying to find the right way. How much how much twits can you actually handle, you know? So, uh, but this is, I think, a great way. Not only that, you know, you you have the uh, at twit, you know, at Davos, uh, you know, you get the whole. Twitter, you know, discussion, you know, so because I think we'll have, you know, last year we had something like 20 people tweeting from Davos. 
I'm sure this year we'll have more people tweeting. So it gives you it gives you a great way to follow the entire debates, the entire conference in Davos. Okay, excellent. Well, I look forward. I will be tweeting from Davos and uh, <laughs> blogging from Davos, which will be fun. And okay. one thing is interesting to see is you're, what you're trying to do is converting. Uh, this meeting into something bigger than just the gathering in in the Swiss Alps. Absolutely, I mean, what we're, you know, it's 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 not a it's not a PR trick. It's we're actually really showing our participants. You know, these are traditional CEOs, traditional companies. What is out there? What you can do on the internet, and and also bringing them into the interactivity in Davos, for example. Once again, we'll have a YouTube video corner where we will actually, you know, we've encouraged participants to actually go in and talk to the YouTube community. You know, so to reply. To their questions, it, it, it's not just you know uh, the forum talking, but it's actually it's a dialogue, and this is something that you know we want to bring to Davos. It's an open, you know, frank dialogue, a conversation. So you know, uh, stay tuned for more, and and you know, and help you know get onto YouTube and uh, put, ask your questions. Excellent, thank you.